A gunman who killed the son of a federal judge may have also intended to target a Supreme Court justice. Judge Esther Salas was in her New Jersey basement. last year when a gunman dressed in a FedEx uniform opened fire at the front door. Her 20-year-old son was killed and her husband was critically wounded. The gunman and attorney who had argued a case before Salas later took his own life. After the shooting, Salas successfully pushed for a New Jersey law that safeguards personal information of judges and other officials. 60 Minutes correspondent Bill Whitaker spoke to Salas about a chilling discovery by the FBI. Judge Salas has become a crusader for federal legislation to scrub judges' personal information from the Internet. Her mission became more urgent when the FBI discovered a second locker in New Jersey belonging to her son's killer. What did they find? What was in the locker? They found another gun, a Glock, more ammunition. But the most troubling thing they found was a manila folder with a workup on Justice Sonia Sotomayor. Supreme Court Justice Sotomayor. Yes. Chilling. What do you think when you find that a Supreme Court justice was on his list? More than on his list, on his sights. Stalking her like he had stalked you? Who knows what could have happened. But we need to understand that judges are at risk. We need to understand that we put ourselves in great danger every day for doing our jobs. Wow. You know, I, remember, those... I remember that story very yeah, well. And yeah. listen, it was, it was heartbreaking on many levels. But when you learn that that was their only child, their only yes. child, it made it even more painful to it's, me. It's heartbreaking for all Americans as well yes. because, you know, attacks on the judicial system are something we're used to hearing about in other countries. And to hear about it here mm -hmm. is a sign of a bad change of circumstances. Yeah, and the gunman literally went right to their front door. Exactly. You know. Front door. You can watch Bill Whitaker's interview with Judge Salas this Sunday on 60 Minutes. And Judge Salas will join us right here Monday on CBS This Morning.